Hello everyone, this is my YouTube series God Talk. In these videos, I will be talking about the God of the Bible, so please like, share, subscribe, and leave any comments or questions down below, especially if you want to help me to get this message out to more people. So the word Jehovah is a word that we have seen used in the Bible several times. This is a form of the Hebrew name of God. Most scholars will believe that the name Jehovah is derived from the Tetragrammaton YHWH, which was revealed to Moses to be the name of God. The Tetragrammaton is basically the word to describe four letters understood to be the name of God. These four letters are the English transliteration of the four Hebrew letters Yod, He, Wa, and He. I have no idea if I pronounced that right. Furthermore, when the word was being translated into Latin, it was translated as the Tetragrammaton J-H-V-H. This Tetragrammaton was later fleshed out with the vowels from Adonai. There is actually a lot of confusion surrounding how to pronounce certain words in the original text because of the changes that have been made to the language and all of the religious convictions to not speak certain words, especially the disuse of the names of God, like Yahweh. It was widely discouraged around the 500th century BC to use these words because of a misinterpretation of the third commandment, which is to not speak the Lord's name in vain. The third commandment is not, do not speak the Lord's name at all. It's true his name is high and lifted up above all other names, and his glory is something that we are certainly unworthy of. But he has already showed humility towards us and that we can share a relationship with him. And yes, even speak his name. This misinterpretation of scripture was well-meaning, I'm sure, but only a man-made rule and tradition. I found out that there are a lot of names like Isaiah, Joshua, Jeremiah, and Jesus that we actually don't know for certain what the original pronunciation was. But... Jesus and Joshua were commonly referenced as Yahashua, which is eerily close to Yahweh and Jehovah mingled together. <laughs> but we can, be, we can rest assured that whether we know how to pronounce God's name or not, His word stands true forever, and we can stand on it and stand by it, and we will not be let down. Thanks so much for watching this video. I'm so glad that you have been searching for the love of God, and I am praying that the Lord will help you to overcome each test and trial that you will have to endure in this life. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe, and if you have anything good to say, you can comment down below.